You know, folks, I'm proud of that flag. You know, there's been a lot of changes since we had this visit two years ago on America's birthday. A lot of changes. But one thing has not changed, and that's my love for my America. You know, two years ago, I might have been taking a few things for granted, but not anymore. Because as I stand before you here tonight, I actually love her more than I ever did. You know, folks, there's something else that has not changed. Here in St. Paul, you see, our foundation might have been shaken, but that's all it was. The house still stands. In 1839, the very first church in the Northwest was built in a log cabin right here in St. Paul, Oregon. The first church in the Pacific Northwest. The land was blessed. The people believed. And in 1843, after that church had been there for about five years, the first college in the Northwest was right here in Little St. Paul, population 425. Is it a coincidence that a town this size can put on a function like this? I say it's not. I say it's because there was a foundation built in 1839, a foundation that was built on God by godly people. And the preservation of that has gone through the generations. <laughs> you see, in life, our foundations can be shaken, but there's always one we can count on. You see, there's a spiritual foundation in this community we don't apologize or ask permission. It is the heart of the people. So with that said tonight, Lord, we ask that you continue to lead us and guide us as individuals, as a community, and as a nation. And Lord, we've, uh, we've fallen. Sometimes we get caught up in believing a lot of negative stuff that scares the daylights out of us. But we need to go back to our foundation. Our real identity is you living in us if we believe. And Lord, we know that through all the trials in life, one thing never changes. And that is you. You're always for us. You're always in our corner. And you're always there to get us with strength through anything life throws at us. Lord, we thank you for that power. We thank you for our foundation. We thank you that you're here tonight. We give this night to you. We appreciate the gift of freedom. And we pray it all in your son's Jesus' name. Amen. Ladies and gentlemen.